so fantastic uh, project which really brings a possibility for the young kids to, to train and to see how it's be to be the professional because of course no one knows everything from the beginning but when you have a good trainers and you have a people who can show you how to operate how to go what to do this is very important i think that this is the main aim for this project and it should work like this My role within the academy is the education part, special education. Explain about riding, explain that is it is not a bulky sport, it has to do with talent of course, it has to do with athletes, it has to do with food, it has to do with concentration. In general what we are explaining to kids that it's also a job. To do motocross, to be a motocross professional, hey, it's a hard life. Because as an athlete, you have to perform all the time, not only on the bike, but also the physical part, talking with your sponsors, being basically be a good kid as well. And that's what we try to learn them. Now we are 10 years doing the academy now, and what we really see is the changes. Also, some kids that were in the academy are in Grand Prix now. That's rewarding. And like today, the kids are listening, they're happy, they really are focused on getting better, getting more safe. Taking care of the environment is a part as well. I mean, we are enjoying nature, we are not abusing it. So, all together, all those things in combination helps the kids and helps us for future motocross and to stay healthy and enjoy our sports in, in a big perspective. It's more like an education for kids and parents to improve the level on, on motocross. So that they have more knowledge what's going on in the paddock, what's going on on the track. So we do some, some riding technique on the track and we also educate them in, uh, in the paddock. My role is a riding coach, so I, my work is to do the, the work on the track to improve the rider, technical, and also in speed-wise in the corners, on the jumps. So that's my job, mainly on the track. Uh, no, first of all, we want to see happy faces with the children. This is number one. And we do it for 10 years now, and it's good, it's working. They, they, they like it, so that's the main thing. And after that, of course, that they learn a lot in only two days' time. So, yes. It's always great, you know, that you see kids on a younger age coming to us in a weekend like this uh, to the academy activities and then they see later on, they see them in the Grand Prix, which is uh, amazing, of course. And it's not uh, by a coincidence because each country takes the better riders also from young, uh, the youngsters to bring them to the academy to 
show them actually what it is to be a Grand Prix rider in a weekend like this. So they are part of the, the, the paddock, they are racing on, or they are practicing on the track. The parents we met inside the media room with workshop, as Jan already told. So it's a complete package and yeah, if you see then riders from young age on, lo on, on a little bit older age participating in the Grand Prix, it's only a, a big plus. We are on the end of our career and uh, the only thing what we can do is uh, to bring our knowledge as far as we have to bring to the trainers, to the riders, but also to the parents. So the three of us has a lot of experience all over the years, which means that we can bring this knowledge to the people who are maybe now struggling with some issues in the sport. And during the workshops or the, the short conversation we have in this weekend like this, yeah, it's always a plus for them, but also a plus for us.